What is going on everybody? Hope you all have a fantastic day so far. My name is Dean Hype. Welcome back to the channel. If you guys could, if you enjoy this video, go down below and drop a like. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys have subscribed to this bitch. Because you guys are never missing out on any of my content. Normally on this channel, I post Call of Duty and GTA content. But I've seen a lot of people that like WWE content. So I decided, since I have 2K17 and I'm big into WWE and I've been doing the career mode. I thought I'd come on here and do some career mode video for you guys because I was going to make a GTA video today but GTA is being stupid and I cannot get in because I have to download files or something I don't even know what's going on if you have this problem also drop in the comments what it is <laughs> and Call of Duty I thought about that but I have there's an update out so I can't get that game started up for a while so I decided let's just do a WWE video so so if you hopefully you enjoy this and let's get straight into it So as we can see, I'm entering the ring right here, and I'm going to go ahead and sim through the entrances because they're pretty boring, and I'm going to be pretty much commentating over this match the entire time because while I was playing, the, whenever I play this game, I have to actually like focus like really hard, and it was triple threat, so I was pretty much fucked. From the begin with so pretty much Rusev jumped out of the ring so I have my chance to attack Del Rio and that's exactly what I did normally in my matches I like to do I like to get up on top ropes and fly off and jump and try to take them down almost to where I can just immobilize them just for a certain amount of time to where I can build up my signature and just finish off the match as you see there I reversed Rusev's move and then I went after Del Rio I missed Del Rio had his went ahead and did a suplex on me so I was on the ground that's when Del Rio took his advantage and went after Rusev so he did that I saw Del Rio laying there so I went over and started punching him took a big kick took him to the ground Rusev got up I had to turn around I didn't know what he was doing he went and threw me off the ropes he I came back reverse hit him over the head kicked him to the floor Del Rio was ready for me I went flying to kind of like a Samojo drop on top of Rusev Del Rio got a hold of me. Did something. I don't know what it is in triple threats, but like it does this where it immobilizes you and you have to lay there until that counter builds up. Or else you can get injured, I guess. Ear quotes, what I just did right there. And that's when Del Rio took his advantage and he went after Rusev. Like, I, whenever Rusev or Del Rio did that, it ended up in that bar. You'll see here in a little while. I climbed out of the ring, tried to hit him, and it wouldn't let me hit him. So I don't know what it is. The Rusev's going to town on Del Rio right now. I see that happening, and I know that they're going to try to make a pin, but I wasn't there to stop it. I got in the ring, started beating up Rusev a little bit. Del Rio, as you can see, is on the floor now, so he has to lay out there for a minute. And that's my chance. I knew I was going to have to go after Rusev because I was almost in my signature, and as you see right there, I just reversed. Now I have my signature, but Rusev had a choke slam ready. So he hit that, pulled me to the middle of the ring, was going to go for a pin. He did not able to... Because Del Rio was there. Del Rio threw Rusev into the corner. I stole that slam into the corner. Del Rio saw me there. I went through my signature, but Del Rio reversed. But not the signature, but more just reversed a move. Like me, in general. He tried to hit a move right there. I reversed. I kicked him. I was trying to figure out how I was going to get him up. So I could just do the signature. So I was like, you know what, let's just try and pin. See what happens. Because Rusev's not even in the ring right now. Let's take that chance. I went for the pin. Didn't happen. We both got up. I was seeing them sitting there. Del Rio got me up. Rusev charged after. I went to the ground. At this point, I'm pretty much just trying to get my signature hit because I knew once I get my signature and then if I can hit my finisher right after on either one of them, it's game over. Like, my signature and my finisher back to back, it's game over. But normally, all I'm able to hit is my signature. I'm never able to get my finisher afterwards. That's why I knew I had to pretty much get them to the point to where they were stunned for that moment to where I can just hit that signature. The other one's not in the ring and I can hit that finisher and they'd be done. At, I see right here, I'm out of the ring. Rusev goes for a giant suplex on the top rope on Del Rio. I hit this signature. Go ahead and F5 and Del Rio's laying there. Rusev is now down. I could go for the pin, but I see Del Rio sitting there. I charge up my finisher. Del Rio steals the, my funda. And he goes and tries to do something to Rusev. I don't know what he was doing there. I guess he was setting him up for the armbar. I punched Del Rio. I went for my finisher. Del Rio reversed it. He has his finisher ready now. Del Rio power slammed me to the ground. 
charged up his finisher. I knew this was about to be game over. I reversed this. And it was a rope break. I climbed back in the ring. Rusev was there ready to go. And as Rusev was attacking me, Dario does roll out of the ring. And he's not there to help. What exactly happens here? Rusev tried to go for a suplex. I countered to reverse into a back suplex. Damn, my phone was going off again. I climbed out of the ring here because, like I said in the beginning, I was going to try to test out and see pretty much what, um, if you could make them get up. And you can't really make them get up whenever they go into that zone. I climb out of this ring. Rusev and Del Rio, they're going at it. Del Rio throws them back into the ring. Hits him in the head, kicks him in the head. I'm starting to get back up. Del Rio is about to take a pin on Rusev. Claim the victory. I couldn't let that happen. I climb back up in here. It's a more right now to one count. I go to break it, and Rusev actually kicks out before I can even break it. Del Rio turns around. He sees me standing there. I kick him in the face. I go for the pin because Rusev is not there. We got a one count. Right now, I see Rusev is climbing to his feet. Del Rio gets right back to his feet. I kick Del Rio in his face. I circle around to distract Rusev. I elbow Rusev to the face. I'm waiting for one of them to get up so I can hit this signature. I see Rusev is immobilized. So I see Del Rio is available to be taken out. So I hit the signature. I'm thinking here, okay, is he ready for a finisher or should I wait a second? Just give it a minute. I'm like, nope. Gotta go for the charge. Gotta just hit it now. Get it done. But that's something I've actually been learning. If you hit your go for your finisher immediately after your signature, you're just gonna get screwed. You gotta wait for it. Because as you see right there, I reversed his finisher as he came back. And he wasn't able to hit put me in his armbar. He tried, I went up to the top row. He was going to try to take me down. I reversed. And I went ahead and did a battering ram to him. Didn't get the pin. I had a two count because Rusev actually broke it. Kicks me in the face with his finisher. Now Rusev's got his finisher already. Got his finisher ready. He had his signature was his kick. His finisher is the accolade. Right here goes for the pin. I kick out. That means Del Rio now knows. Oh, I got to get up. I got to make this happen. Del Rio goes over to Rusev. Puts Rusev in the corner. Del Rio goes at him. He picks him up, sets him up for his finisher, because what if you don't know what Del Rio does, he pretty much gets up to the top rope and just jumps down on top of Rusev. I went over, drop kicked him. I was gonna try to hit my signature, try to build up the signature for Del Rio, but it didn't happen. Del Rio got me in a three count. Cause I can't I was struggling because normally the bar doesn't go that fast, normally it goes slower. And I struggled there. But I did take the L in that match, I'll tell I'll agree to that. But now we're seeing me do my promo. And pretty much my promo, a promo on WK17 is like, you know, whenever like a superstar comes out and just talks for a minute. It's pretty much all I'm doing. Like, Miss TV, WWE, if you know what it is. It's pretty much all I'm doing. But I'm just going out and just kind of just having a talk. I try, I like to have my face up a lot. One day I might make it just straight heel. Can I see my face is actually up pretty high. I actually went with, um, the not everyone respects me, except for you, for the WWE Universe. If you want, you can read it real quick. Um, I think I skipped it a little few times. You can see it says you know how I feel about the universe. Pretty much says like I fight for you every night and nobody ever pretty much respects you and I'm not standing for that. Right here it's you've oh uh, what did I pick here? Don't assault my fans. I was trying to be like more face because there's been a certain superstar and if you don't know what I'm really much talking about right here if you want to, you can go back and pause that. Pretty much, I'm in the rivalry with John Cena. A fan favorite. Because John Cena ambushed me. And now I'm in a heated rivalry with him. Because, like I said, I'm going after that WWE title. For Not the WWE title. The WWE United States title. I'm going after that. And I'm pretty much putting a rivalry. Like I, I don't hate Cena. But in this game, I'm making it as if I do hate Cena. And my rivalry with him is already at the five bar. It's been with that for a long time. And right here I say he can face me anywhere, anytime. Because I want to build my guy as somebody who he will fight anywhere, anytime, any place. Doesn't matter where it is. Doesn't matter if it's in the ring. I'll fight anywhere. <coughs> and on my last word, I think I hit. I'm going to smash you. 
I don't think that was a good choice. I, I thought that was going to be more of a face. I didn't think it was going to heal. And I sound like an idiot when I said that. But it was my mistake. Let's go ahead and head over to the next. So as you guys see here, this kind of right here is the whole point of the video. What I was trying to do. Because right here, as you can see by my ranking, I'm number 5 in the United States Championship run. And the video is throughout like the weeks I'm gonna be making videos about how my journey to number one and possibly getting a United States championship and doing a lot of a lot of rivalries with John Cena because he is the United States champion. I'm trying to move up and the only way to move up is to possibly beat the champion and beat people higher up in your ranking. So pretty much I'm number five. Alberto Del Rio and Rusev just beat me and they were lower. So they probably moved up. I am up at number five. So I'm trying to move up. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to actually do a live match because the other one I was just commentating over. And now this one I'm actually going to like go into the match and I'm going to be here like you guys are going to hear like my reaction to everything that's going on in the match with Del Rio. So let's get right to that. Here we go. Time to kick it off. Match number one. Let's go. Ding, ding, ding. And we're underway. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. Well, in these head-to-head -head matchups, you've got do. no one to rely on but yourself. Hit there. And that's the way it should be. I wish I could do like the reverse backflip you know onto him. I would do that. No other way. I'd like signature. Ooh. Wait, who, who do you think you are? Oh, no, you didn't. Reverse that. Throw you over the rope. King incoming. Take you oh, out. And so taking a look at Alberto here. Del Rio, any thoughts like come to out. mind? That'd it's be cool. been a long slog, but he's number six in the world right now. Does he have enough to off. win this thing? We're going to oh, find out a lot here tonight. Head to head, no excuses. Oh, Let's get it on. Stop there. Oh, slaps on that cross get up. Arm breaker. It's get up, almost bitch. a guarantee that you will tap I'll throw out. you in the steel step. Fuck, I missed. Get up. If I can get you up. You fat ass. Ooh, I got some of the steel steps. Reverse. Oh, what the fuck? Reverse. Reverse, little bitch. Complete with a big stop. Yeah, you thought. These guys are throwing bombs. They're pulling out all the stops. Six. I don't know if we've seen that from him before. I mean, it's definitely a first tonight. This is great. This guy'll try anything. Look at this. He's going back to an old friend with that one. <laughs> You're right about that. You gotta remember. Come on, ref. Count. He doesn't want to win this one outside the oh, ring. Oh, come because on. He's a pro king. He wants to get it done inside. I thought he was going to count him out. Focusing on the chest now. Fine, if I can't beat you outside the ring, I'll beat you in the ring. Nicely executed. Yeah, sit down. What the fuck? I had that first. Reverse. No ref. No ref. Oh, don't matter. Don't There's no ref. The last time he executed that maneuver. He started Damn to it. show signs of fatigue. With these two guys, we all knew this was going to be an all out. Come on, do something. Battle. I'm not concerned. Bitch. I don't think I've ever seen him look more motivated than he looked oh, heading God. into this. Oh god. Now you do suplex. Point, John. And I'd say this match was a suplex city. Suplex defeat at this point. Come on, bitch. Right now. Yeah, you when thought. Going like this, there are few better. F5, motherfucker. Yeet. He's on the defensive here. My God, his All right, my question is, is ribs, am I able to do this finisher? Probably not. Well, let's take a, a chance. Ribs like that can make it hard to oh, breathe. we can? Wow, on first try. That's actually surprising. Now that is just dangerous. No now he's got a. Oh, why you gotta go that way? Oh, we'll pin. And I won. All right, that worked. This one's over. Sorry about that. That was my phone. But one, two, three on the first finisher. That is how it's done. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed this match. 
let's skip to back to the main screen so I can do this outro. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. Please make sure you guys go down below, hit the like button if you guys did enjoy it. Drop in the comments what kind of videos you like, you guys would like to see. Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel if you were new. If you were not new and you have been here before and you are watching again, let me know in the comments how my videos are coming and what you guys do want to see. And yeah, that has been it. Enjoy your rest of your day. Peace out.